guys. I'm gonna be outside for a few hours and it's really hot here. So I really wanna do a natural makeup look just cause I'm gonna be baking in the sun. So it is so hot here and I'm just like trying to figure out what I should do in terms of makeup. I don't want my foundation to just be melting off my face all day and like look really cakey. I'm wondering if I should just do concealer contour and not use foundation. Move the camera angle. The lighting is super weird in here, but it's okay. So I just have the flawless filter on right now. I think I'm gonna do no foundation. First gonna go in with the Charlotte Tilbury contour. If you didn't know, my boyfriend plays professional tennis. So that's why I'm in Australia right now. He is here for a grand slam. I'm not gonna act like I'm an expert in tennis. I'm definitely still learning, but there are only four grand slams in a year. So it's a pretty big deal. These are definitely the biggest tournaments of the year. They're just really exciting tournaments to be at. And yeah, that's why I am here. I really do love watching tennis. It was not a sport that I watched very often. My mom is a big tennis fan and she watches tennis, but I didn't grow up watching tennis really. So it's been pretty fun for me to get into it. Next, I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of shape tape to start and then I'm gonna build it up. But I have always wanted to go to Australia so bad. So I'm so excited to be here. He had a tournament before this that I didn't come to and he's been here training for a few days, just like practicing. This is like the beginning of a long season and I'm gonna be traveling with him as much as I can. Part of the reason on top of the other reasons why I came back to YouTube was I felt like travel vlogs, specifically the type of traveling that I'm doing with my boyfriend, I feel like kind of deserves a little bit more time and like I just can't fit a travel vlog on a three minute TikTok. So I was gonna wear my hair up today. I always straighten my hair before I put it up. I don't know if you guys do that, but I straightened it to wear it up and then whenever I wear like little dresses, I like wearing my hair down. I don't know why. This is it so far without any foundation. The reason I do normally often wear foundation is because I feel like it looks better in photos. But in person, I think this looks better, especially in the sun. I'm gonna go with this Maybelline Instant Age Eraser on my forehead and then my upper lip. I get these freckles on my upper lip and I don't mind them, but when I am doing makeup, I do tend to cover them, honestly. I get so nervous at his matches, like my anxiety is insane. Okay, let's do my eyebrows. Also guys, thank you for being so supportive about me coming back to YouTube. Like you guys have sent me the sweetest messages and you really all do feel like my friends, so Thank you for the nice words. It's really encouraging and I'm really excited to be back. Okay, I'm just gonna skip to lips before I do my eyes because I haven't decided yet. I have a new lip combination that I really like. I use the Charlotte Tilbury Iconic Nude. Just like a brown nude. Any brown sort of thing would work. Okay, then I'm gonna go in with this Benefit rose lip tint this one is actually my favorite the pink lemonade more like barbie sort of pink but i think this stains better so the first layer i do is this and right before i leave at the very end i'll put that pink lemonade but i'm just gonna let this stain and listen you put this shit on and it's gonna look really dark and crazy. Let it marinate. Let it sit. Let it like get in there. It will not look this bright when you're like leaving. Okay, I still don't know what I'm gonna do with my eyes, but I'm gonna powder my under eyes and my eyelid. I use this infallible 24 hour fresh wear. And I use this Huda Beauty brush. It's like my absolute favorite brush for powder. 
and this shit is so full coverage i am not gonna use this on my full face because i will look cakey if i do like um but you gotta be careful during the day because this shit will make you look very matte and very full coverage like it's thick like i think it's fire like it makes everything look so bright just be careful with her i do it on my eyelids because i like my eyelids to look very bright okay i'm gonna go in with tempura it's like a light very whitish pink shimmery which sounds kind of crazy but it doesn't really show up like that i just feel like it's super brightening like pretty oh wait it kind of has a little bit of purple in it i'm gonna look like i'm going to like some euphoria themed fucking party and i'm like going to a tennis match one thing I always forget to do is contour my nose, so I'm gonna do that today. One of my new favorite mascaras is this Kush Mascara by Milk Makeup. It's very natural and it like really just separates the lashes. It doesn't like give crazy drama, but look. It's just like nice and simple. Like just a normal, nice, just coats your lashes and doesn't make them clumpy. Sometimes I want the clumpy, like night out, winged eyeliner, fake lashes. The Huda Beauty is a little more for that, but for daytime looks, I will be using this. Okay, there we have it. I'm gonna contour my nose with this Anastasia in Chestnut. It's a really pretty color brown. That might have been a little dark. Like I really do feel like contouring your nose makes a big difference. Just for like the dimension of your face. Okay, I'm gonna go over my lip liner again. And then I'm going to add a little bit of the pink lemonade, like I said. This combo is unmatched. I really think lip liner lip looks is all about like mixing a lot of different things. I feel like I need a necklace. Oh wait, eyebrow gel. Milk makeup eyebrow gel. He sent me a PR package a bit ago and this was just laying around and I grabbed it before I left. I do really like it. I like how small um, the applicator is. It's just like easy and cute and small. And then I'm gonna use the Charlotte Tilbury airbrush Flawless setting spray. I have to say guys, like as someone who's been doing their makeup for so long, like I love makeup, always have loved makeup. Tried everything, I feel like. This is the only setting spray that like doesn't smell like ass. Love the 24 hour uh, fucking Urban Decay shit, but like it literally smells like ass. I'm sorry, but. I've been really loving the salt and stone deodorant in Santal. Okay guys, I feel like I am good to go. Besides the fact that I'm wearing granny panties right now. And then I'm wearing Converse, platform Converse for some height with the dress. Cause it's a little dress and height's always nice. Okay guys, I literally never do this. Ah, that's a lie. Is this even champagne? Okay, I actually don't know if this is even champagne. Okay, I hate this. Ah! Okay. All right, folks, definitely champagne. Cheers, guys. It's actually pretty good. I have some time until I have to leave, so. <laughs> Tommy emailed me this morning. <laughs> it's like, what did he email me? No subject. Hey, I love you. <laughs> Oh, he's so cute. Okay, I think Tommy called a car for me, so I'm gonna finish my glass and then head down. I will see you guys at the site. So 
the tournament has been temporarily stopped because of heat. And I've just taken it upon myself to get some sun. vlog much. Babe. Oh, he just hit his head on the lamp. <laughs> I'm not feeling well. Okay. I think we're all fucking We just look we look good. Nice. Florida. Yeah, go go great. It's really hard being you're getting part of that. Okay, we're going to dinner at Nobu. Let me take over. <laughs> okay. <laughs> dinner was good. What did you think? Yeah, and the tacos. You didn't like the tacos. I love those tacos. Yeah, they're kind of they're kind of nasty. And it is Tuesday, so. I like the miso soup. Should we lose some money in the casino real quick? Yeah. So now we're gonna go get treatment because the hitting partner. Needs yeah, Seba, Seba's gonna come rub me down a little bit. Yeah. And then he's gonna do some work on the hitting partner because <laughs> she's been real busy waiting on. Seba is Tommy's physio. Is that what you call it? Yep. And start Atlanta, DC. Oh, my camera's about to die. Bye, guys. <laughs> no, no, no. No, no. Plug, plug it back in. There's more. There's more to this night. <laughs> P, back in her element, doing her work. Who are you about to have a meeting with? Raylan and Olivia. What are y'all gonna talk about? Um, I don't know if Olivia's joining. 